I'm Miranda Valentine, editor of the lifestyle blog Everything Sounds Better in French, and today I'm going to show you how to make Rachel Ray's red potatoes and thyme. So I have our ingredients all laid out here. We have two pounds of red potatoes that have been quartered and boiled until fork tender, about 10 to 12 minutes. Then we have salt and pepper, which we're going to do just to taste, two tablespoons of unsalted butter, one tablespoon of extra virgin olive oil, and then five to six sprigs, about two tablespoons of fresh thyme, which has been stripped and then chopped. So I have a nice kind of deepish skillet over here that has been warming on medium heat, and I'm going to start by putting in my butter and my olive oil and melting those together. Won't take very long at all. Just put those in there, give it a nice turn because we want to make sure the whole pan is totally coated. And you, of course, want to make sure that your pan's not too high because we don't want the butter to burn. We just want it to melt. So give that a little help here with your, with your spatula. Beautiful, beautiful. And as soon as this is all melted, which is going to happen in just a moment, we're going to add in our potatoes. So let's give this one pat of butter. Let's give this one pat of butter just another moment. Okay, beautiful. So let's add in our potatoes. You can hear that nice sizzle. Kind of spread them out. You want to make sure that you have a pan large enough, obviously, to fit all of your potatoes and that they can all be kind of in one single layer on the bottom because these are going to get nice, a little bit brown. So they're already cooked through, they're already fork tender, but we're going to get a little yumminess brown going on. You can just kind of toss them, give them a little toss. If your pan's not too heavy, you could do, you know, the nice little shake thing, but you just want to make sure that they're all nicely coated in olive oil. Okay, great. Now next up, let's season with our salt and our pepper. And this is to taste, so if you like a lot, use a lot. If you like a little, use a little bit. Remember, um, you can always add more, but you can't take out. So just start with a little bit, taste it, add more, or stay put. That's, that's why we call it to taste. And now let's add in the thyme. So we're just seasoning these beautiful potatoes right now. So now what we're going to do is let them cook in the pan um, for about seven to eight minutes, only stirring occasionally until they start to get a little bit brown. That's all we're looking for is just a little bit of that crunchy, yummy brown. So we'll come back in seven to eight minutes and see how they look. Okay, it's been seven minutes and as you can see, we have this lovely browning happening here, which is exactly what we want. So we're going to turn off our heat and the great part is, you know, we've already cooked these till fork tender, so we know they're good to go. Let's just... We don't have to worry about the, you know, whether they're cooked all the way through. Let's just pour these on. Whoop, little man down. We'll just put him over there. So there we go. This smells so fantastic. Just take a look at this beautiful brown, nummy goodness, but you have some soft parts, some, you know, yummy, yummy, delicious, toasty bits. It's all ready to go. A fantastic side dish. This would actually be amazing as like breakfast potatoes or as a side dish for dinner. So versatile, so delicious. Rachel Ray's Red Potatoes and Thyme. Thanks for watching. Make sure to subscribe. And if there's something that you want to learn how to make, send me an email at request at mahalo.com. And don't forget to check out our other great videos.